this concert. My name is Alex Dubroff, and I've been involved in gun violence prevention since my son was in kindergarten seven years ago. I remember that day clearly as I ran to meet him after school with tears streaming down my face after learning about the horror in Sandy Hook. Since that day, myself and so many others have been fighting for gun safety in this country. Phil, from the town crier, has been a stalwart supporter since that very first concert six years ago. Please join me in round of applause for Phil. Thank you so much. I also want to extend a huge thank you to Susan Wright, who pulled together tonight's lineup, I don't see her, as well as all of the other amazing artists who are here tonight. And I also want to thank you. I want to thank you for being here. I thank you for not accepting the status quo. I thank you for raising your voice and song and unity and unity with others at the town crier tonight. All proceeds from tonight will go to the Afterlife, a nonprofit started by Broadway production manager Joseph De Lelise. Here he is to tell you a little bit more about what his organization is doing. Joe. Hi everybody. My name is Joseph DeLuise, and as Alex mentioned, I started a company called The After Lead. About a year ago, I, as many of you see on the news every day, you see these shootings and they're not stopping. And it took me about eight months to realize that if I didn't do something, no one else seemed to be doing anything. There's a lot of different companies out there. So when I started researching this, I had the idea, I'm sure that I would be one of many companies doing this and I wouldn't be able to help in a way that I really could because the market was watered down. After looking into it, nothing. There are no national companies that have the same mission that I do. And I knew that this was a fight that I wanted to join and win. You may hear about uh, many movements that have been started to fight gun violence and the missions are good. I mean, all of those missions are good, but the problem is, is that all of that money gets filtered up into political parties, right? Whether you're a Republican or Democrat or Independent, and I think all of the politics have their own problems, but that money goes to political parties and it doesn't go to the people that I think really need the money. So we started a company called The After Lead. We came up with the name The After Lead because we're leading the aftermath. These things are happening every day, and there's hundreds of thousands of people that need this money and they need our support. This crisis, um, I officially launched this company eight weeks ago, and I really appreciate being here. Thanks to Tom and Susan and Alex. Um, like I said, if you wanna go and buy a t-shirt for somebody and have the proceeds from that t-shirt go to the elephants, which need the money. I'm not saying that the elephants don't need the money. You can do that. And there's companies out there that gave $1.7 million to Africa and the elephants. And I'm saying that's a good, that's a good cause. But I think that there's so many people in this country that need our support. And that's why I came up with the After League. So we're selling t-shirts and hats, magnets and stamps over there so you guys can buy it. You can also donate to us. 100% of the donations go directly to the survivors. Um, like I said, we started this company right after Labor Day this year. And this past Friday, we gave out our first $500 donation uh, to the Dayton Foundation for the shootings in Dayton, Ohio on August 4th. So, um, I really appreciate all of your support. If you can't buy a t-shirt and hat, if you could follow us on Instagram or Facebook or go on our website, that would help. The biggest thing is getting our movement across the country. Like, I grew up in Wappingers Falls right here. And like Alex said, I'm a production manager down on Broadway. So um, Broadway has been my passion my whole life, but this is something that I know that I have to do. And I know that's gonna go far and mean something. And I hope that we can save lives. Um, so along with selling t-shirts and hats, like I said, I, I'm a production manager on Broadway. We opened Tina, the Tina Turner musical, last week, and we have raffle tickets. So the raffle tickets are $10, and we're selling them over there, and the drawing's on November 10th, and we'll email you or call you if you win, so you don't have to be there to enter the raffle. So thanks for having me. Enjoy the concert. I look forward to meeting all of you. Thank you.